how did people find their way across the planet before the time of GPS without navigational instruments? How did Polynesians navigate across thousands of miles of the Pacific Ocean to find their new homelands? How did people predict the weather patterns before the advent of supercomputer models? Hi, I'm John Huth, an instructor for Finding Our Way. In this course, we'll explore these questions and teach many real-life skills that will stick with you. Not only is navigation a useful skill, but it is also a cognitive template that carries over into other skills, like future planning, where we have to take into account uncertainties. One unique aspect of this course is that we will use our environment as a kind of laboratory for developing and testing these skills. We begin with the simplest of all navigational skills called dead reckoning, which is simply keeping track of distances and directions to figure out our position. We also look at lost person behavior. It's when things go wrong with navigation and how different people get lost in different ways. Next, we develop map and compass work and make a map of our local surroundings. We then turn to the sun and stars as a way of navigating. By the time we're done, you should be able to orient yourself day or night by looking up at a clear sky and find your latitude and longitude with surprising ease. We'll look at ocean waves and currents and how Pacific island cultures navigated by sensing wave patterns. Finally, we'll turn to how our concept of time evolved from the observation of celestial motions as a kind of natural clock and calendar. All of these concepts are tested with assignments that you, that you carry out in your immediate environment. 